the real increase here is in custodial services mm -hmm. for the building. Um, we have noticed that uh, the time that we've allocated to clean the building and keep it clean is insufficient. The building's getting older. It's requiring more and more time to get it cleaned out each day. Uh, so this represents um, an increase, a small increase in the number of personnel. We now have two part-time people working to clean the building, and we will have next year. Yeah. Um, okay. We want to make sure that the building represents the community, and we want to make sure it stays clean. So it is a 55.83% increase. We're going from 13,800 to 20,725 uh, to get those two part-time employees to get them in here and keep this building in good shape. The building's getting older, it's requiring a lot more work, and we also do work as individual employees during the course of the day to try to keep the building in shape. So you'll see when we get to uh, building maintenance, for instance, uh, we have uh, gone from uh, 29,860 to 34,284. Uh, right now we're looking at uh, changing the heating system in the tax collector's office because it's so cold in there in the winter time that the uh, girls actually have to wear pockets to work in on a windy day. So we're looking at correcting that. We have some other problems to correct in the building dealing with heat and uh, not air conditioning but with heat. Um, the drive up window for instance needs to be completely replaced. That will come next year so we can get that done. There will be a warrant article to replace the interior door, front door, so that we can have that one handicapped accessible. And that will, we'll be asking in the warrant article, if the board's agreeable to it, to take that $15,000 from surplus. It's something that needs to be done yes. so that we can be in compliance with handicapped accessibility. Yeah. That's not in the budget, but it's there. Uh, electric bills are relatively fat, tw flat, 20, 21.6 to 22,000. Uh, heating fuel, 8,900 to 9,000. Uh, water, $3,010 to 2,505. That's the result of a rate decrease that they're projecting. And building maintenance from 29,860 to 34,284. There are systems that we need to replace in the building if we're going to continue to use it. Okay. Anyone have any questions on this budget? I don't have any problems. I would just like to say that um, after having been here for many years, I can tell you the building is visibly cleaner than, it us than it's been in the past. That's particularly true for the bathrooms. Yes. Mm -hmm. And uh, it shows, and I think it's money well spent. It goes yeah. a long way to making it a happy workplace. Yeah. It does, and it took a lot of effort to get the bathrooms finally cleaned, and I know we've talked about that before mm -hmm. because they were in terrible condition. Yeah. We're still working on that to try to get them even cleaner because it needs to happen. <laughs> yeah. You're doing a great job. Thank you, sir, and our staff is doing a tremendous job helping us getting this done.